2-1-0. Blast off for India's latest space mission. Launched from the eastern coast of the Indian island of Sri Harakota, Aditya L1 is off. On a one and a half million kilometer quest to study the sun's outer layers. And we have a confirmation of Aditya L1 separation. The mission has been accomplished. And with that, some relief for scientists at the ground control of the Indian Space Research Organization, or ISRO. The craft is heading for Lagrange Point 1, also known as L1, where the gravity of the Earth and Sun are balanced. The Aditya L1 will take its uh, journey after some Earth maneuvers. It will start its journey to the L1 point, a uh, very long journey of almost 125 days. So let us wish all the very best to Aditya spacecraft. ISRO says the orbiter's specialized instruments will study the three outer layers of the sun. We are going to get the complete picture. If, if I put in a layman terms, it's like we are going to get the black and white image, the colored image and the high definition image, 4K image of the sun, so that we don't miss out on anything that's happening on the sun. Scientists say the probe could also shed light on solar weather. An objective, a science goal of trying to understand um, the activity of the sun, um, in particular how that um, shows itself as solar flares um, and more extreme events called coronal mass ejections. We're more and more reliant on satellites um, for our day-to-day -day lives um, and particularly um, strong solar activity can actually affect some of those satellites that we, that we rely on. It's been just over a week since India carried out its first landing of a rover near the moon's south pole. It's only the fourth country to successfully carry out a lunar landing. And this latest success is propelling India into becoming one of the leading players in outer space. Laura Khan, Al Jazeera. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.